I've got another mystery box, so let's get into it. Now this mystery box was a limited time only. Again, that's how they get you. You you give me you slap limited on there and I'm like, all right, I'm there. Now of course it is sold out, but let's get the full lingo down here. This is a limited time event. See, I'm getting you. Chrono Toys High Roller Plus Mystery Box 2022 San Diego Comic Con Edition. Say that time. Say that ten times fast. It's not gonna happen. Now. The reason why we got this is, of course, San Diego Comic-Con just happened. We didn't go. And also, there's the box of fun that happened. Say a what? And we missed out on that. Don't know how, don't know why. You ever get into something, and you're brand new, and you go full hog? Is that, that's the term. And you buy everything, but you miss out on the key thing, right? That's like the big event. And you go, oh, yeah, no, uh didn't um that was a thing so but you know you know what they say don't cry over uh spilled milk which why are we crying over spilled milk unless that milk was in a bowl of cereal you know then i'd be crying over the cereal maybe but a spilled glass of milk i mean why we that was that was an actual thing and nowadays you know i heard that this is a totally different tangent i heard milk is that they're trying to tell me that milk isn't even healthy. I mean, I haven't had milk in, in I don't know how long, but you Google anything and it's bound to, to be true. And now there's so many different types of milk. Like there are people who live under this roof who, who can't have, you know, the precious dairy. So I, I haven't had a regular glass of milk in forever. And, you know, like I've been saying, I had people come out. We went to the store and I thought, oh, maybe we'll get regular milk for and I'll have regular milk. They got oat milk. Oat? What? How? And I know this is a poor joke, but what do you? Who's squeezing oats? Like what? I I looked him square in the face. I said, D- please. D- that's not. What is? What is that? Oat milk. Oh, it looks like water. It doesn't even look like milk. Tastes delicious. I I I can't I can't figure it out. I'm supposed to be hating on all the different types of milks, and I didn't drink the milk at first. I was like, no, it's oat milk. It's not real milk, and it looks like water. I'm not you pouring that you pouring water on your cereal, okay? And I'm crying over that. Don't spill that, okay? And I and we'll all be better off for it. But then after they left and it was still in the fridge, I I wanted a bowl of cereal, and it was the only milk we had, so. Oh my goodness, it was delicious. That water, delicious. Milky water. Who who, who knew? So, anyways. Uh, Chrono Toys Mystery Box San Diego Comic Con. Let me read you guys the description here. Uh, one randomized pop. Uh, guaranteed value of $25 or more. Each uh, mystery box for $25. You get a total of four. Of course, we bought four because... You didn't get a box of fun, so you can make up again. It's all about excuses and rolling it over. And those rollover minutes, you just roll over the money. Oh, we couldn't spend it here. Yes, spend it over there. And so, but you got chances to win a box of fun Freddy Funkos, which, you know, kind of the whole reason. Uh, San Diego Comic Con stickered exclusives. What? And PSA signed and graded Gem Mint 10 exclusives. So we bought four. Let's crack into it because, you know, you guys don't want to hear me talk about milk anymore. Oat milk. One little light. Like I'm gonna be able to tell by the weight. Although now that I say that, this feels a little bit heavier. I'm just kidding. Ooh. Sometimes I think you like create that stuff in your mind. You're like, oh, it's this this one feels a, a little bit heavier than the rest. Although it kind of does. Okay, so I'm super excited. Let's just crack into it, open them up. That's what you came here to see. Hoo-wee. 
I didn't get to like hide this one. This one like I got woken up to come do it. You gotta do this now. It's here. It's here. Okay, first pop. Oh, this is pretty cool. We have a Bruce Lee bait exclusive. Hmm. How interesting. Bruce Lee. That's actually kind of a cool pop. Was not expecting that. I'll, I'll look up the, the values once we're all done here, but um, there you go. Bruce Lee, be like water. Uh, mystery box number two. How interesting. I've never seen that before. Oh. oh, this is cool. The bubble wrap has defeated me. Perfect. We have Chris Sanchez. I totally butchered that. Do you see how like the wind up in the pitch? That is the uh, shared exclusive from Boba Fett, the Wookiee himself. I'm just gonna say that because you guys don't wanna hear me say that name again. And you know what's super ironic is I literally just went and pre-ordered that, that exact one. So, you know, <laughs> there's that. I think that was the heavy box too. And that makes sense because it's a Wookiee now. Third pop. I can't even tell. How interesting. We have Astro Boy. Is this? I have no idea what this is. But that is interesting. Is that a... I don't know what that is, so I'm not even gonna try. But Astro Boy, and he's half, half there. Half machine? He's not, he's fully there, but he's, half of him is not, you know. I didn't even cut that. Final box is the most trickiest. And last but not least, we have the man himself, Michael Jordan, from the Bulls. How interesting, as well. Was not expecting all these bait exclusives. Um, but let's go ahead and look up uh, the prices, or the, you know, the pop price guide, which should give us a little bit of a what are these. You know, the other reason why we got this too is because you ever, like, you miss out on something and then you watch, for whatever reason, we decided to watch everybody else who got one open up their box of fun and we're just over and over again, box after box are going, oh my goodness, look at that, look at, and look, and look at that. And I think that's what, like, double hyped us up over this mystery box because we had watched, like, 20. I was like, why do we, we got to stop watching these. We, we didn't get one. Like, we're not going to get one. Like, it's okay. Like... You know, don't cry over spilled milk, which, you know, as we learn, kind of an iffy thing. But, you know, it, it it's like when you're hungry and you watch the, the cooking channel and, and you're sitting there and an actual chef is cooking a meal and it's the most delicious thing in the world. You have no idea what, it, even if you have no idea what it is, it looks amazing because, of course, you're hungry. And, and even though you can't smell, you know, the, the cooking, which that is 
good cooking, the smells, the aromas that, that tantalize the taste buds, that is how they get you. So, you, you know, when, when you're doing those types of things, that's how you wind up, you know, uh, uh, doing this. Or, you know, back to the food thing, when you're watching the Food Network and you're hungry, you wind up ordering food. Because you're like, wow, that looks super good and a lot of work. Let's have somebody else bring that to me right now. Well, not that, because that looks... I'm not going to get that, but I'll get something that I can eat while I finish watching them make this. And they never eat everything. You ever notice that in the Food Network? Like, they cook a whole meal, and then everybody has, like, eight bites, and then you're like, does the audience get the rest? Like, how does that... How does that all kind of work? All right, well, I'm I, I'm I'm going off off the, uh, the the rails here. So let's let's look up uh, Astro Boy, uh, which my phone decided to look up uh, astronomy. So there's that. All right, and we're back. I just decided because I got lost and then I couldn't type in Astro Boy and it kept coming up with astronomy and then I started gazing up at the night sky. No, I'm just kidding. So let's go through some of these prices. I'm actually super shocked at all of them. We did pretty good. So uh, let's see here. Let's start off with Michael Jordan, the man, the myth, the legend himself. You know, come up and jam in space. He's coming in at $42. So, uh, wow. Uh, already, so box number one, already overvalued because that 25 a box, that's 42 you know. Now, Astro Boy, half man himself. I got to figure out what this is because that's interesting. But Astro Boy is coming in at $37. Not too, not, not too shabby. Not too shabby at all. And uh, Chris Anton here. Ooh, did I get the name right this time? Who knows? But I did it anyways. He is coming in. The shared sticker, $40. Now, I'm expecting that one to come down a little bit only because it still hasn't like hit stores and this is the shared one. But pretty cool himself. And finally... But not last, Bruce Lee, Be Like Water. Uh, he's coming in at $34. I've never seen that pop. I didn't even know Bruce Lee was a Funko Pop. And there he is uh, kicking. And this says uh, Game of Death. Also don't know what that is. And so I should probably figure that out. Because I, even though it's funny how, how some bigger name people, like you know their name and you might know like, you know, one or two things like, fists of the dragon or something like that but other than that you're like oh you know the name and some of the accomplishments but then like the people who actually grew up on these people are like you don't know such and such from 19 such and such see you don't even hide and this is why you lose us because you're like I, well, all i heard was blah 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 did you see this? And already you know by explaining all this with my dumb look on my face. I don't know what you're talking about. So, anyways. <laughs> there you go on that. This was actually a lot of fun. Super interesting. I was not expecting uh, any of this. Mostly the bait exclusives. I gotta figure out what that is. I've never even seen that store before. But, some really cool pops. I actually am gonna have to go with... Uh, the Michael Jordan as my favorite because one I saw this documentary on Netflix and it's crazy like the his whole the whole history of like the Bulls and the team and the championships I'm not a sports person but I was actually thoroughly like captivated by that story and come on it's Michael Jordan you gotta wake up to the Space Jam uh, Chris Santon Boba Fett would have been my number one if I didn't just get him yesterday which is cool because now I have him twice. No, I have him once. And so, anyways, uh, with that, I'm going to get out of here because that was a lot of fun. And uh, we'll catch you guys all in the next one. Until next time, bye-bye.